T minus 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, Atlas Ignition, 2, 1, and lift off, lift off, not long lines, Atlas 5 rocket, the fifth space based infrared system satellite, the United States Space Force. Seconds in the flight, PU's gone to close loop control. Engine operating parameters continue to look good. You're hearing the voice of Patrick Moore from the launch vehicle as I did. Vehicle's now completing the pitch over program, body rates look good. Some good chamber pressure on both SRVs. And I'm ready to now beginning the throttle bucket. Engine response looks good. And we have good indication of stage separation. We have pre-start on the RL-10, standing by for ignition. Ignition and full thrust on the RL-10. Chamber pressure looks good. Body rates look good. And we have good indication of payload fairing jettison. This first burn of today's mission will last approximately 10 minutes, 30 seconds. RL-10 engine operating parameters look good. Body rates have damped out nicely from the startup transients. And the RCS system is thruster firings for system thermal conditioning. Just over. Propellant utilization system is continuing to control appropriately in the closed loop mode. Body rates remain stable. Now coming up on 14 minutes into flight. And about one minute now remaining until main engine cutoff. Chamber pressure continues to look good on the RL-10. Body rates remain stable. About 35 seconds now remaining until engine cutoff. And we're seeing good pressures on helium and hydrazine storage bottles. And standing by for engine cutoff shortly.
And we have Miko, main engine cut off. Body rates look good. Centaur now engaging for us, settling as expected.